Today, we're going to show you how to install the HDL300 audio conferencing system. It's a simple installation, so let's get started. With your system, you will receive the following parts. Before you begin, ensure you have all the necessary tools and supplies on hand. You'll need the following items to get your system up and running. When determining where to install your system, it's important to note that the microphone array is located along the bottom edge of the microphone and speaker bar. In order to optimize microphone pickup, we recommend hanging the microphone and speaker bar between 83 and 120 inches from the floor. Select the central location and ensure you provide adequate clearance between the microphone array and any objects directly below the unit. Avoid hanging the bar directly above interactive displays or other hardware with fans, as the noise can cause interference with the microphones. Once you have determined where you are hanging the speaker bar, set your laser level to that height. Then measure and mark the bar's screw placement. The mounting holes are 31 and a half inches apart. Drill in the number 10 size screws and anchors. You'll want to leave enough room between the screws and the wall to hang the unit. It's easier to connect the ethernet cable before the unit is on the wall, so plug it in first, then hang the bar on the screws. For this installation, we drilled a hole behind the unit and fished the cable down in order to hide the wiring. You can also use wire covers or route the wires a different way in order to fit your location's aesthetic. If you plan on using the optional mounting bracket for the breakout box, the easiest way to install it is to hold the bracket up to the wall, make sure it's level, and then mark the two mounting keyholes. Remove the bracket and drill in two number 10 size screws and anchors. Now, all you need to do is attach the bracket to the breakout box using the screws provided with your system and hang it up. To connect your system, plug the ethernet cable into the back of the breakout box and use the USB cable to connect the breakout box to your PC. Plug in the breakout box power cord to power on your whole system. The last step is to set the HDL300 as the default playback and recording device for your audio conferencing software and operating system. Your new audio conferencing system is now ready to use.